Hi YouTube. How's your all's day going? Mine is going fine. Today I'll be doing an updated review on this Kalis International uh, hand braided wig. Stay tuned. Okay, they see you. Uh huh, now he's running. Stay tuned. Okay, this wig is from Kalis International, and her name is Stella. And I have it in the number one color, and it's 22 inches long. And let me turn and show y'all that it's nice and full in the back. And I found a, um, a nude colored cap to wear under it to make these parts stand out better. So you see how thick it is if you can't see the cap through the braids. Okay, let me sit sideways in this chair. And like I said, it's 22 inches long. It goes way past the bra strap in the back. Okay, back to the specifications of this wig. It came with a little short comb here and a little short comb there. And the same size comb right at the nape by the tag. It came with two adjustable straps, you know, with the hooks. Okay, I cut out those combs. I sewed in a longer comb right here for security. And I cut the hooks off of those adjustable straps. And I sewed those together. Sewed the two elastic straps together. I also, also, uh, Put an elastic band, so an elastic band from ear tab to ear tab, and it goes across the back for security. I still pin all my wigs. I put a long bobby pin behind my ear, and I put another bobby pin right. It's up here somewhere, cause I don't want nothing slipping or sliding. Okay. This wig had straight micro braids, so last week I just braided about maybe 12 or 13 braids, secured them at the ends, and dipped them in boiling hot water to get these waves. And I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, let me tell you. Let me show you what uh, I use for my edges use this Gorilla Snot for my edges. It dries clear and it, it, really, <clears throat> it really holds. So they have, it'll show you uh, the hold meter on the back. So it has the tin. And this comes in different color bottles. I think there's a yellow bottle and a blue one. I got the purple. No special reason. And it comes out the bottle. It's green. And it actually smells like toothpaste. Now, if you were blind or doing this in the dark, you would think you grabbed the toothpaste. And it's real, real sticky, ooey gooey. Okay? But it works. Okay. This is the stocking cap I have on. It's the cheapest one you can buy from Walmart. It was 79 cent. And it's a knee high. And it actually, and the color of this is oatmeal. And it better matches my scalp color. And this is how the, uh, the band look, how wide the band is. So it's comfy. It stretches. Because I can't stand nothing, you know, I can't stand no vice around my head. Well, this one is very comfortable. I had one before. I had to take that mess off. It was squeezing my head. I said, uh -uh. I can't hang. I knew by the end of the day I would have a terrible headache. 
but I don't even feel this one. This is the little brush I used to try to get these edges. They have one that looks like this at Walmart, but it's real, real stiff. And it'll have your edges bleeding if you use that. Because I had bought it. I took that thing back and got this one. So it's nice. It's not too stiff. And I don't know where I got this comb from, but I used this too to pull out some hair. Okay. I hate to take this wig off, but I'm going to show y'all. So. I got a bobby pin back here behind this ear. One back here behind this ear. There's one up here somewhere. That's kind of you, these big ones. They're actually roller pins because they're wider right here. Okay. Okay, I'm going to lift this off. Let me take this thing off. Woo! All right. And previously I had put concealer in these parts. Okay, this is what I did to the inside. Okay, I sewed this long comb. I took this out of one of my old tray wigs. You know, I'm a wig wearer. See, this is the long comb I put in here. It's a big improvement. It feels more secure. Okay, this is the elastic band I put from ear tab to ear tab. See, this is actually an ear tab. So I don't have to be bothered with the ear tab sticking out, you know, flapping right here. And this goes up under my tucked under braid. Okay, I actually sewed an elastic to join these, uh, Adjustable straps. Like I said, I took the hooks off. See, this is an elastic strap right here. And here's the other one. And I took the hooks off. And I just took some, you know, regular elastic, like waistband elastic. And sewed it to each end of the straps. So it's more secure at the nape. And there's the little cone. See that comb? And there's the tag. And let me show y'all how the inside of the cap looks. Just, let me see. Okay, like I said, this is lace front. And here's the lace from ear to ear. And the rest of it. This very stretchy wig cap construction and very airy. And there's the band I sewed on. I sewed this on as opposed to using this kind right there because I don't want this, you know, um, an elastic strap to rub against my hair. It might put it out so this has uh, satin on it easier on my hair but I do put this up under my tucked under braid and this goes up under that so it makes it more secure it holds the ear tabs ear flaps whatever you call them holds them down securely and I think it's a beautiful and well-made wig So next week, I think I'm going to roll them so I have little corkscrew curls. I just hope I don't make the wig bald-headed. 
Okay, so that's my review of this Kalis International hand braided micro braid wig. Okay. And like I said, it's 22 inches long and it's in the color number one. And the name of this wig is Stella. Okay, thanks for watching. And leave a nice comment. Give me a thumbs up and you all have a blessed day. Bye. Thank you.